win, place, show, and exacto wagering here. And here are the starters. Number one is Mayfair Classic. Owned by Rod Bartlett and Jacqueline Wary of Westfield, Indiana. Tom Simmons, the trainer driver. Number two, Patchy Mana. Owned by Philip and Robert Reitveld. Trained by Mark Carpenter, Dean McGee in the bike. Number three is H.J.'s Legend. Owned by Janet Emerson of Golconda. Trained by Harley Emerson. Connell Willis is up. Number four, Respect My Authority. Owned by Jennifer Lappy of Riverton. Trained by Richard Lappy. And Tony Morgan will be the driver. Number five, Willie Select, owned by Ray Hanna and Dick Corson of Altamont and St. Peter, trained by Ray Hanna, Dale Heitman is up. Number six, Hideaway DP, owned by A.E. Dameron of Kevill, Kentucky, trained and driven by David Dameron. Number seven, Sammy Can Dance, owned by Ellen B. Stables of Tinley Park, trained by Bob Neheiser Jr., Dave McGee is up. Number eight, Bill Source, trained and driven by co-owner Candy Schooley, co-owned by Nate Scholler, all of Kentucky. And number nine, A.J.'s Sammy, owned by Dixie Graham of Salem and by Sam Lilly of Downers Grove, trained by Jerry Graham. The driver is Andy Miller. Post time in five minutes. They are an eighth of a mile from the start. Here they come. And Sammy Condense is off stride behind the gate. The rest are off and trotting. A.J. Sammy guns out for the early lead. Mayfair Classic comes away trotting in second. Hideaway DP gets out third, followed by Pat Shimana as they move into the first turn. And now there goes Mayfair Classic moving up from the inside to get the lead by a neck. But still, A.J. Sammy is right alongside, and now he regains the advantage. A.J. Sammy is on top by a length and a half. Mayfair Classic second by five. And Patchy Mana is racing third as they trot by the quarter-mile mark. Hideaway DP is fourth. Respect my authority. Trotting in fifth. The opening quarter went in 29 and two-fifth seconds. Bill's source is sixth. Willie selects seventh. And a long way back to Sammy Candance, who is next to last. And H.J.'s legend trails the field. On the back stretch now, Mayfair Classic trots up on the outside. And he gets the lead for Tom Simmons in the maroon and white colors before the half. Mayfair Classic leading A.J. Sammy by a length and a half. Three more lengths to Hideaway DP in third. Respect my authority. Moving up and forth on the outside. And then Patch Imana is shuffled to fifth. The half in 101 and three. Patch Imana is off stride. At the entry to the far turn, Mayfair Classic, the leader by three parts of a length. Hideaway DP is second to length. And then A.J. Sammy third by a neck. Respect my authority. Fourth on the outside, just two lengths off the leader. Then a gap of three to Willie Select, who moves into contention fifth, and Bill's source is right behind him. Mayfair Classic off three quarters and 133 and one is leading it by just ahead with Hideaway DP right alongside. In fact, now he takes the lead. Respect my authority. Third on the outside. He'll have to come to the center of the track. They're moving by the eighth pole. Mayfair Classic, an awkward move. He made a break. It is Hideaway DP leading at a length and a half. Respect my authority, trotting up strongly on the inside. Will he select his third? Respect my authority. Gets up on the outside, or in the inside, rather, to win it by three parts of a length on the outside. Hideaway DP second. Will he select third? 203 and one fifth the time for the mile. A famous phrase. Now, ladies and gentlemen, now returning. Here is that trotter. 203 and 1. Tony Morgan has the winning drive. Respect My Authority, owned by Jennifer Lappy of Riverton, Illinois, trained by her husband Richard. This two year old trotter, a gelded son of Heather Wallace, with a master Willie Dam, was bred by Duncan Foundry and Machine Works. Incorporated, and yes, we double-checked. It was the Lappies and not Sam Duncan, which put that South Park name on this trotter. He was renamed after being purchased, and now he moves into the winner's circle, his uh, second victory of the season, and the result official. The 4-6 exact a combination, $227.20.
and an affectionate hug for the winner from the owner, Jennifer Lappy. I believe Ed Teefy's catch up with perhaps the winning driver down trackside who is signing an autograph at the moment. Let's go down and talk to Ed Teefy, who's with Tony Morgan. Thank you, Kurt. Tony Morgan, former national driving champion. This is Tony's first win of this year's State Fair, but I'm sure we're going to see Tony back in the winner's circle a lot during the 1999 uh, Illinois State Fair. Tony, respect my authority. Had a record of 223 and 4 coming in here, and I think you made the owner, Jennifer Laffey, a very happy young lady. He's a very nice trotter. I raced him at Balmoral, and uh, he's good and solid. Uh, get, takes to the hobbles real well, and real nice little Cole. Congratulations to Tony Morgan. I'm sure we'll see Tony back in the winner's circle this week. Thank you, Kurt. Thank you, Ed Teefee, and congratulations to the connections of number four.